No shitting is yet to stay, and so is your Wi-Fi. This Wi-Fi UPS found in Transignal electrical cells, you can have Wi-Fi during low shit. So this Wi-Fi UPS over here replaces your normal power supply that you usually plug into the wall and into your window in the easy electricity. Okay, so let's show you how it works. Step number one, you have to take your Wi-Fi router and check on your router if it's either a 5 volt DC or 9 volt DC or 12 volt DC. If we check our one over here, you'll see that it's actually a 9 volt DC. Okay, so in this box, besides the UPS, you'll find a few cables and connectors to connect various items for charging during load shedding, as well as the user manual. Okay, so now we're going to connect the 9 volt output of the Wi-Fi UPS into the 9 volt input of the Wi-Fi router where the power supply is supposed to be. So once your Wi-Fi UPS is on, if you check the Wi-Fi router, you'll see that there's a green light over there which indicates that the power is connected. Always keep the power cable in as your UPS becomes now your main power supply. And remember that this UPS can also be used on a fiber box. It has a lithium ion battery and can last up to seven hours when fully charged. If you are looking for a solution, pop in and try signal electrical cells either in 21 Harrington Street, Cape Town, or at our Monoton branch at Unit 12, Stodos, Stirrup Way, Garden Centre.